Democrats on the House Financial Services Committee grilled the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau's new chief Kathy Craninger on Thursday in her first appearance before Congress since she was appointed in December. Craninger was questioned about decisions made under her predecessor, Mick Mulvaney, as well as about the Bureau's role in protecting service members and student debtors and was at one point asked to calculate the annual percentage rate on a hypothetical payday loan. Freshman California representative Katie Porter posed the math problem and provided the agency chief with a calculator. Porter, a former law professor who brought along the textbook she wrote titled Modern Consumer Law, also quizzed Craninger about the definition of an interest rate. Craninger declined to answer, responding, "This is not a math exercise. Democrats are concerned, not just that Craninger may lack the expertise to lead the bureau." but also that she will follow Mulvaney's playbook and scale back enforcement actions. Many Republicans have long argued that the Bureau has overstepped its authority and created burdensome standards for businesses. Craninger worked for Mulvaney at the Office of Management and Budget and stepped into his shoes at the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau when he became President Donald Trump's acting chief of staff in December. During his tenure running the Consumer Bureau, Mick Mulvaney, who is currently President Trump's acting chief of staff, took many actions that hurt consumers, said California Representative Maxine Waters, the committee chair. She accused Mulvaney of stripping divisions within the Bureau of Enforcement power, installing unqualified political employees and setting cozied up to payday lenders. In a sharp line of questioning, Waters asked Craninger if her office had initiated any new investigations over possible fair lending violations since her tenure began in December. I can assure you that fair lending is of continuing priority for the Bureau. Supervision and enforcement work is ongoing, Craninger said, when interrupted by Waters. What you're saying is no, the chairwoman said, before moving on to another question. Under Craninger, the Bureau has proposed rolling back a rule drafted under Obama appointee Richard Cordray that was meant to protect consumers from predatory payday lenders. The agency is currently accepting public comments before formally rescinding part of the rule. 